Welcome back to Let's Play Hot Wheels Ultimate Racing. Does Alex really have a preferred environment? I don't know if he... If I ever really felt that they, he did. I mean, he can probably handle himself anywhere, honestly, but... And of course, Vert, we have the whole water thing. Burn being from space. All the Velocity X characters in the, the city. Oh, a little bit of aggression there. So who's that in front? I don't recognize that one. That one's a little weird. So there's some new opponent as well, in addition to... I think... Yeah, we saw, I'm pretty sure we saw Otto's... Whatever here. At one point, don't we? God, this thing still throws me off. I don't quite know how to get past it. I feel like you want to fake it out. Get it to stop somewhere as it tries to... snap at you, and then go around it, but... It doesn't feel very easy to do if you're moving directly towards it. But we do, of course, also have Alex's phone here. See if they can hold their own. I don't think it's... The unfortunate thing is I don't know who is... which name is standing, so I don't know who's finishing how. If I'm ahead the entire time, I don't really see him ever. I only ever see there are others if I'm having a hard time with them. Ah! I feel like I got close that time. You really don't have to worry much about sliding against walls in this game. It doesn't slow you down much, it doesn't feel like. I just took my hand off the controller for a moment there just to scratch my hand. My other hand, that is. I'm sure you could probably scratch one hand with itself, but that would probably be a bit more difficult than it would be worth it. So you had access to your other hand. Ooh. So I don't know if I have a hard an easy time with that one compared to the other though. Leaving the ground. I kind of instinctively from out there actually want to leave the ground, so I started holding down on the controller. You play too much wipeout, and by that I mean I haven't played wipeout in like at least five years, probably. I don't know why I still have intuition. I move right into it that time for it. I don't know why I still have intuition from that game. I'm playing it now. Granted, I was playing Wipeout HD Fury, and I'm playing this using the exact same controller. Not literally just the same type of controller, a PS3 controller, but also literally the same controller that I played that game with. So I guess that might be part of why. Though I do like that I've managed to figure out how the handbrake works in this game. It's kind of nice how it feels once you actually understand it. I feel like. Oh, not much happened there. Yvonne still got second, but we're still ahead by quite a lot. No problem so far, not like what Gearhead had to deal with. Gearhead did not have the best experience because everyone hated him. I think Alex has won everybody else's favor and respect a little bit more, even his opponents probably. Sounds. Okay. Take that, robot. Is that that's not the one huh? is that the one that I call to one of autos? One of autos guys? Is it? It might be. Making certain certainly make an odd sound. Maybe it is. Whatever it is, I'm not gonna outrace Alex, I can tell you that. See ya. And of course, love to see things go on a little bit more between Alex and the doppelganger, but maybe they're not even worth keeping around. I mean, all they are, of course, is that they're just another Alex robot from back in Bash Arena that just happened to somehow survive the whole thing. As far as I'm aware, there's nothing special about them. They're nothing especially hardy or fast or anything. So it would make them particularly useful to the robots, I'm not sure. Whatever the case, it's not 
nothing of consequence to Alex himself, regardless of the similarity in appearance. Nothing cannot do the real deal. The whole making fakes thing hasn't really usually seemed to work out that well in the past, although it's worked out alright. It's come close, I guess, in the past before. There was, of course, Dusty Angel, the clone of 16 Angels, who was a pretty competent racer in their own right. And there were, were the clones of... Well, there the, they were the many imperfect clones of... Of Twin Mill. Interesting, seen Twin Mill hasn't been here actually for that matter. Yeah. See, I can make turns now, it's beautiful. Alex knows his way out around a handbrake. Oh, well, it's probably best not to just <laughs> keep tapping on a turn like that, it just slows you down. The, the, there were all the imperfect clones of Twin Mill as well back in Track Attack, just like Dusty Angel. Except those ones were great in quantity, and they didn't really fare much better. In fact, Dusty Angel turned out to be a much more capable racer, it seemed like. So I'm going to try to go for the highest speed I can right here on this loop when we get to it, though. So I think that's where I think it's a rare opportunity to get a really high speed. Higher than what you normally get because you're on a hill. Uh, maybe not. I guess not. Oh well. And should not overshoot that too by not holding the boost the entire time I was in the air. So does boost still give you a boost while you're in the air? I think it does, because I think that's why I managed to overshoot those jumps like crazy before. Of course I had a contingency plan. Alex would never do something so reckless without knowing what they're gonna do to handle themselves. My intention there was to, ah, a little early. My intention was to just brake if I had to while in the air, because for some reason these cars have air brakes. Hey, at the, the very least, everybody has those things, so I guess it's nothing unfair. Although XU3 definitely still seems to be, I heard someone below me. XU3 still seems to have, <laughs> yep, there's everyone driving past, way behind. XU3 seems to have most aerodynamic build out of anyone here. Zoom. Yeah, this car is a pretty. Seems like the speed caps in this game are pretty hard caps. I don't know if there's anything you can do to get past the, your car's top speed. Oh man, someone got closer. Eve, I'm tempted to say, think that Ivan would be, because of their Russian sounding name, they'd be. Oh wait, no. I thought it was a Russian, never mind. Whatever. Although, whoever it is is catching up. If it turns out to be the Alex copy, they might actually be something to be reckoned with. Of course, of all people, Alex probably wouldn't be the one to falter towards the end here. They don't usually choke. Of course, there is the question of whatever made them drop out of the most recent Stone Jack Challenge, too. So it's not like they've never... One second. Ah, darn cord. Cord on my controller got stuck in the... got stuck underneath my desk. Ah. I mentioned before, these things are cheap and... Nothing special. I need to get, get out of this guy though. I need to actually take this guy seriously. I can't just stick around messing with the clone. Hey, he hits walls too. Look at that. I can hit all the walls just as well as you can. Beautiful. Does nature like Alex? Oh, darn. Nature does not like Alex. That's unfortunate. Ooh. Okay. 
in that case. I don't wonder why nature wouldn't like Alex. That's a very good question. I mean, Gearhead, nobody likes Gearhead. Probably organic or otherwise, for that matter. But especially organic things. Get up to speed. And stay on speed. Darn it. Stop hitting things. We're good. Not on boost, but still. Aha! So that's the way to go, apparently. But yeah, you would think. I mean, maybe they got some re some reinforced, I don't know, whatever, some armor or something. Some read on body work, but that Alex clone, if they're anything like the others, should not be anything much to worry about in terms of resilience. This is a tried and true route, so I might as well take it. Third time. That wasn't very true. But I did try. Regardless. Put my trust in your nature. Be nice to me. Okay. I don't know, maybe the tree just thought Alex was the... Alex clone at first or something. Whatever the case, we are done here. Not bad. Ooh, what happened to Yvonne? Oh, what happened to Alex there? Bad job, Alex. If I, if we assume that Yvonne was the Alex robot who's been getting closer each time, something happened that time. Something happened to him. That's not good. I don't know if they're under a little bit of damage or what. He's got switched up this time. Maybe they did incur some damage, we'll see. Whatever the case, I'll see you guys next time in the next episode. Let's play Hot Wheels Ultimate Racing, where I head on to the desert. And we will, I suppose, finish this tournament as well. We'll see what comes after that, if anything. We'll see what the conclusion of the tournament is. So far, humans are still ahead. Whatever the case. Bye, everyone.